am just getting back in. Um, I did some hair this morning and I went to visit some family. Changed my hair. Should have left it like it was. Here nor there. Today, I'm gonna be doing a get unready with me and opening some packages as well. Some have already been opened, but opening some packages, the last one that I was waiting on just came in today. These are the packages that I'm going to be opening today after we get unready. I usually wash my face after the shower. I don't know why, it's just a thing that I do. I know my hair look crazy. The first thing is, is this body butter from Relax and Release Tranquility. Love it. So when I first got it, okay, wait. First, while I'm putting it on, I do unscented on my face and unscented on my feet because, nah, I don't put nothing scented on my face and nothing scented on my feet. So um, how I met the girl who makes this is we were out one night and a lady was a little tipsy but I don't remember if she was already talking I don't think she was talking about it already what how I remember it is um and she probably is in the background of um that vlog where we was out that night um her, I think he was her brother, was talking to us. Um, and I want to say she walked up and started talking to him or she walked past. And I remember complimenting her on her skin because, oh my God, her skin is so pretty and brown and so even. Um, and that's when she started telling me about this. So I put in my orders and I got them. Now the first, I can't stand dry lips either. I hate for my lips to be dry. So, I got, so the first week, um, that I used it. I used it one night because I didn't want to, you know, dive in here first. But that next morning, my face was so moisturized. It wasn't just greasy on top like Vaseline, but it wasn't as absorbent as fast as lotion absorbs in your skin. So when I tell you I love this stuff, I love it. And let me tell you, Three things I'm always gonna remember about somebody when I meet them is nice skin, nice teeth, and the way they smell. I'm always gonna remember those. Um, so when I met up with her that day, she gave me a sample of her strawberry pound cake. She had that with her. And when I tell you that scent stayed on my hand from the time I put it on until I got home and got ready to take a shower, that scent stayed on and it smelled so good. And she did give me a self-care card on how to store it so it doesn't melt and um, how to use it. So I got the strawberry pound cake and I didn't open mine. I was waiting to do this review. I already know how it smells and it smells so good. So usually, when I take my uh, evening showers, I usually like to, oh my God, y'all. Oh my God. This smell like strawberry ice cream and pound cake. Oh my God, oh my God. Usually, uh, when I take my evening bath and showers, I usually like to use like a men's body wash because I like the way it scents up my pillows and <sighs> it helps me on my lonely nights. It helps a girl get through. 
I can't wait to take it around and let other people smell it and other people try it. And I hope they want to buy some. I hope she gets her money. Um, I'm going to put, this is her Instagram right here. So please go and take a look at what she has to offer and get you some body butter because baby, this stuff works and smells so good i'm not i promise you i'm not exaggerating i'm not i listen none of this stuff is sponsored everything i bought i bought from my money so i don't have no reason to over exaggerate baby my son can tell you i every time i open this i talk about how good i smell how much i love it so that was that now we're going to move on to the second thing already open because I've already worn it is ring from I think it's pronounced Viva Mocity, uh the mood ring so I lost my wrapping because of course I like I said I already unboxed it so it came with a handwritten note hi Chancel I hope you love your new mood ring thank you for your support by Viva Mocity. And it also came with a little booklet and your warranty and the materials. And it came with a cute little envelope case with, I believe it has like a polishing cloth in here too. And it came with a polishing cloth. And it came in a cute box. Now, I was watching this ring um, for a while. It came across my Instagram timeline. I was like, oh, that's cute. So when I saw it, I thought, oh, that's nothing I probably can't find on, you know, on uh, Amazon or Etsy, but I cannot, or I could not. So I had to order it. Now, when I went on their website to see how much it was, it was at the time, on sale for $45. I should have gotten it then, so I watched it and watched it and watched it. I watched it for probably about four months and it would not go back down. It went back up to 65 and then it went back down to 60. So I did order it when it was 60. So they have this particular ring. They do have other jewelry as well, of course, but they do have uh, this particular ring. You can get it lined in silver or you can get it lined in gold and while this is not real gold this is the gold that um you can wash your hands in and it doesn't leave the green ring around your finger but i just thought that this was so cute and so different outside of just my little normal gold media rings love that the third thing now before i open this what I'm already disappointed about is in this bag, it does not look already how it looked on um, Amazon. It looked more filled out and square and in this bag, it looks a little, a little slim. So um, let's see what it's looking like. Now I did uh, get this bag because I do have a straw bag, but it is, very small and at one point I called myself getting rid of all of my small hand getting rid of all of my big handbags so I could only tote small ones now I want my big ones back because I gave them all away and I needed something that was big and beachy and cute and summery and when I saw this I was like oh my god it's cute and this is by QTKJ um, it does close by drawstring and it's folded half folded down into the bag so that's kind of cool you take your stuff on the beach you stuff it in there and oh it's like a little picnic but this i like that made me like this even more honey oh okay i wish it was a little more boxy but it's still cute i feel like it all the same it will definitely hold more <laughs> than what the bag that I have now does. And this bag was um, 48 or 45. 
I don't know. I'll put it somewhere on the screen, but yeah, she's cute. I like, I like, and I like the brown with the neutral color. I like, I like, so yeah. Okay, so the last thing. Oh, I felt like I had more. I kind of felt like Christmas a little bit, but okay, we are already on the last thing, whatever. I have been watching this bag for about, I'll tell you exactly how long I've been watching it. March 13th. I've been stalking it since March because I didn't want to pay what it cost. So what I did was I started looking to see when it was gonna go on sale. I mean, I probably check every other day, if not every day, checking on this bag. I was even going on like, it, it just came out not too long ago. So I was even going on Poshmark to see if somebody had bought it and didn't like it and wanted to sell their used one, nothing, no luck. Um, it was on eBay for four seventy five, but that was only twenty five dollars off. I don't trust eBay to buy a five hundred dollar bag for a twenty five dollar discount. I would just spend the twenty five dollars and get it directly from Miss Kate Spade herself. So, yeah. So one day. I happened to be browsing the Macy's website, checking on the bag again, just to see it. Because Kate Spade does, this is loud, because Kate Spade does have, and I saw it come across my Instagram, she had a like a 70% off sale. So I was like, okay, well maybe this is on sale. It wasn't. So I kept checking and kept checking. And one day, oh one day, this bag went on sale for three, 48, I believe. Yeah, the bag went on sale for three, four, originally 500, well, originally 498, and it went on sale for 348. Maybe I ordered that bag so fast. So let's see what she's looking like. Cause I have been stalking you. Okay, Katie, you don't come in there. Oh, girl, you big. And let's see what papers are down in here. Box her. Polo Ralph Lauren for men. Is this the boy from, um, what's that show? Is it Euphoria? That's that guy. Sunglasses hut. No, I don't need that. And 50% off of DoorDash delivery. Oh, 50% off your first order and a zero dollar delivery. I will be taking advantage of that one tipsy night. Okay, so let's get into camp. Let's get, I have been needing so bad. A big, this is bigger than I thought. Now they show you the person with the bag. I don't know, maybe it feels so big after holding the other one. Okay. Now, you know, they show you the picture of the person with the bag on um, the website, but she's Louise. I don't get a little cute duck bag at least. Lock foot, honey. I think she's just so cute. I love neutral colors. I love neutral colors. I love colors too. And the only two big bags that I do have left is neon pink and a yellow one. Anyway. Oh, and she got a little magnetic clamp. Y'all heard that? <laughs> Let's hear it again. Mmm. Okay, I do get a dust bag. I'm like, come on, Kate, you can give me a dust bag. It's a huge dust bag, right? <laughs> so you do have, boom, all of that. You got your zipper back, like most bags do have. 
pretty deep. And then you got your two little front pockets, the one for like the cell phone and the keys or whatever. Now, what I don't like about this bag, my only complaint, oh, I love her, I love her, I love her, I love her, I love her. Love this color, baby. Oof, love the size. The only thing that I will say that I don't like about this bag is it's a soft bottom. It does have feet, so that's cool. But I don't like soft bottom bags because as I'm walking with the purse on my shoulder, I feel like my stuff in it is going to do that. And I don't like that. I do like a hard bottom purse sometimes, but I'll take it, baby, for the look. So me and uh, Miss Spade here, We'll probably be rocking for some years because oh yes this is the Kate spade quilted evelyn bag no this is the baby i can't say all that it's a mouthful i'm gonna put it here but they do also have this bag in black all of these things i bought with my money none of it is sponsored so <laughs> these videos are gonna be few and far in between as far as like unboxing. Now, who knows, maybe one day this could be like a PR sponsorship video, but for now, that is the end of my unboxing of the four things that I got. I love everything that I have. So yeah, if you made it this far, you made it to the end and thank you for watching.